Hello, Scorpio. I missed you guys. Scorpio, happy Sunday. I hope you're having a great weekend. So it's Sunday morning where I am. So you want to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. That's what we're going to do. First, we're going to ask what's coming towards you, how you're currently doing on the soulmate journey. And second part of the video, we're going to ask about your soulmate, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. We're going to ask what's going on with your soulmate, how they are relating to you at this time emotionally, and what's on their mind, what they're thinking, feeling, um, especially in relation to you. I just looked on the bottom of the deck. A lot of you are dealing uh, with a Leo, but they could be any sign whatsoever. This person is holding on to you. Oh my goodness. They're holding on to you, not releasing you. Yeah. Four of Pentacles with the sun. This person feels enormous connection spiritually, emotionally with you. Let's see. Universe, please step in, <clears throat> show very clear and important messages for the sign of Scorpio, for Scorpio's highest good, please. Universe, what's coming towards Scorpio? What will Scorpio be dealing with facing? And how is Scorpio currently doing on this soulmate journey they on? <clears throat> what's coming towards Scorpio? And how is Scorpio currently doing on this soulmate journey they on? Let's see, Scorpio. Whoa, you love this person a lot, Scorpio. This is you quietly loving this person from a distance at this time. This is you loving your person. King of Cups means unexpressed love, secret love, hidden love. You love this person a lot, but not telling them. Very attracted to this person. <clears throat> You're very attracted to them. Yeah, this is you making an assessment of this current situation this is you waiting for the right time to figure out how to proceed because you love this person yeah you see you feel connected with them two of cups is being held by the star so this is you feeling enormous connection with them like spiritually emotionally unable to release them let them go this is you loving them quietly from a distance at this time yeah See, this is you at a crossroad, trying to figure out, making a wise assessment of the whole situation, trying to figure out the best way to proceed. This is temporary. Eventually, you will see clearly what you need to do. <coughs> Universe, please show us. Um, all signs are showing up here, so you could be dealing with any astrological sign. There could be any astrological sign. Universe, please show us. What's coming towards Scorpio? And how is Scorpio currently doing on this soulmate journey they on? Oh my goodness. Look at this powerful double whammy, double strong message. King of Cups, King of Cups. We're reading energy, not genders. So they could be whichever gender. They could be either sign, whichever sign. Um, this is them being in love with you quietly and you loving them quietly. So both of you feel this deep love from each other. You see, you are holding a cup of love and they holding a cup of love. And here the star is holding the two of cups here, showing you that even though there are challenges right now between you two, the two of you love each other unconditionally on a soul level, past life connection with this person. Oh my. <laughs> you saw me shuffle, right? Look at this, king of cups, king of cups. Queen of Wands, Queen of Wands. So both of you feel deep love for each other and both of you feel deep passion for each other. This this has never happened to me before like this twice. King of Cups, King of Cups, Queen of Cups. I'm sorry, Queen of Pen uh, Wands, Queen of Wands. The same suit. Kings of the same suit, Queens of the same suit. So both of you feel a lot of love and passion towards each other. Look at this. This has a potential of long-term relationship. Look at this. Ten of Pentacles, long-term relationship. This has a potential of long-term relationship between you two. Yeah, so there was some wishy-washy behavior. There was some wishy-washy behavior. So somebody was in and out, in and out. This has been in and out connection. In and out connection. Uh... No communication. Yeah. Yeah, you guys haven't been communicating effectively. This has been off and on relationship or connection. <clears throat> yeah. 
you guys feel a lot of passion towards each other love knight of cups temperance patience you guys are trying to be patient with the the whole process trying to make a wise assessment a lot of you are dealing with sagittarius aquarius yeah you haven't given up on this so this is you holding on even though you feel tired exhausted drained you holding on this is you waiting on communication of great importance you guys are so connected oh my goodness the lovers gemini represented with this card the two of you have been together many lifetimes many lifetimes in matrimony romantic connections look at this strong connection from past lifetimes this is enormous connection the two of you are feeling towards each other let me clarify this and then we're going to go into your soulmate's energy see what's going on with them universe please show us what's coming towards scorpio how is scorpio currently doing on this soulmate journey you are very disappointed scorpio you see you're showing up as queen of swords energy with your sword pointing down this is you heartbroken disappointed sad um trying to make wise decision based on logic sound judgment intellect you don't want to be swayed by your emotions on how to proceed with this situation yeah this is good you're gonna make the right decision for yourself yeah look at this wish fulfillment be careful what you wish for scorpio because you're gonna get your wish so be careful what you wish for this is you seeing uh, this as major problem for you right now this is you not seeing clearly this is you having a lot of questions no answers this is you fearful of making the wrong decision you're gonna make the right decision just trust your judgment inner knowingness wisdom don't rush in foolishly you will make the right decision yeah this is you feeling unappreciated at this time emotionally uncertain if you should reach out with some kind of emotional offer or not this is you doubting yourself you will see clearly what you need to do <clears throat> universe please show us the soulmate of scorpio the soulmate of scorpio what's going on with the soulmate of scorpio and how is the soulmate of scorpio towards scorpio this one wants to come out as extra universe <clears throat> how is the soulmate of scorpio towards scorpio Ooh, reverse king of pentacles this person is not taking any action right now so there's something toxic showing up here the two of you uh left off not on good terms this is them feeling very bound to you unable to release you unable to let you go yeah they are unable to let you go uh, but yet not taking action right now right now they're not taking action they feel bound to you they're trying to figure out the best way to proceed they have a lot of passion for you they want to communicate with you yeah but they stuck they feel stuck right now not sure if you want to communicate with them or not not sure if they should reach out or not but they want to this is them right now not taking action so this person was not reciprocal for some reason they weren't able to reciprocate in this connection with you they were absent they were more out of your life than they were in your life and they see that um ooh. so this person feels enormous amount of guilt regret heartbreak sadness thinking about what could have been it's like they're suffering in silence but they want to communicate with you Universe, please show us what's going on with the soulmate of Scorpio and how is the soulmate of Scorpio towards Scorpio. A lot of you are dealing with Libra, Capricorn, Sagittarius, Virgo. See, this person wants to create some kind of harmony between you two, reconnect with you, but they're not taking action right now. They have a lot of passion for you. This person has enormous amount of passion for you. They would like to have a new beginning with you. They can't let you go. They're not le releasing you, not letting you go. Yeah, you see? So this has been in and out co connection between you two. In and out, in and out. They've been in and out of your life. Not consistent, uh, non-committal. <clears throat> yeah, 
they feel like they need to clear the air with you, like they need to be a communication that needs to happen between you two. They're silent right now, trying to heal, to figure out the best way to proceed. So they're silent not to hurt you or spite you, but because they feel it's not the right time. Yeah, you see, they're waiting. They're waiting to see what you're going to do. Yeah, they want to be successful at this. This person doesn't want to lose you. They don't want to lose you. A lot of you are dealing with the Cancerian and Pisces also. They're missing you a lot. So this person is missing you a lot. They feel sad without you. Yeah, this is them missing you a lot. This is them wanting to be in your life. Let me see what's going on with that Nine of Swords. This is them feeling very disconnected, sad, heartbroken, thinking about what could have been, having a lot of deep regrets for whatever happened. <clears throat> yeah, you see? I just looked on the bottom of the deck, Three of Swords, so this person feels deep heartbreak. Yeah, about this not working out. Universe, please show us what are the soulmate's energy, the soulmate of Scorpio, how is the soulmate of Scorpio and how is the soulmate of Scorpio towards Scorpio? This is them praying, hoping, wishing for something awesome to happen, for some kind of awesome resolution. This is them uh, not losing faith completely. This is them praying, wishing for something good to happen. Yeah, you see, they're not taking action right now, though. This is them feeling like their hands are bound behind their back. Again, hanged men, Pisces energy, Taurus energy. Missing you a lot, not giving up on you. This person is holding on to you. They're holding on to you. They're not releasing you, not letting you go. Yeah, you see, they want clear communication to clear the air between the two of you, holding the sword upright, which is good. Justice, so they want to handle this justly. They're trying to put themselves in your shoes, sort of speak, to figure out how you may possibly be feeling right now towards them or thinking. Um... They want to make right decisions. This person is not letting you go, not releasing you. Scorpio, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about your soulmate's true long-term intentions and plans for you at this time. Then we're going to ask what they're hiding from you at this time, whether they're hiding it on purpose or can't communicate for whatever reason. But the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you from universe, from spirit, on how to best handle the soulmate connection at this time. And anything else you need to know about your life, whether it's your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Scorpio, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below, and I'll see you there. Love you guys.